Welcome to My Long Island TV. From Manhasset to Montauk, we have traveled our communities to bring you the following events. I'm your host, Waldo Cabrera. My Long Island TV starts now. Air shows are one of America's greatest pastimes. I'm lucky to be able to fly in this air show, but even luckier to come down here to the beach. So much excitement, Blue Angels. It's gonna be a great day here in Long Island. I'm gonna give them 10 minutes of everything I got. Hardcore, unlimited aerobatics. We're gonna make the MXS go about 260 miles an hour. Do a maneuver that's an end over end maneuver called the pinwheel. We'll make the airplane tumble, do a knife edge spin. It's gonna be a lot of fun. The Air National Guard is a world class organization. You know, it's uh, got 107,000 men and women all across the nation with over 188 career fields to choose from. It's really like a hometown Air Force because you get the technical skills and training and you work in your own hometown. And for the men and women that are between 17 and 39, we got a lot to offer. You can get your college paid for and much, much more. So come check it out. We got the 106 Rescue Wing right here in Long Island. Great unit. Give the recruiters a buzz and see what we can do for you. Basically, we're out here today to spread some community awareness about the Air Force Reserve and the Air Force Reserve's opportunities. Oh, the commitment is simple. It's one week in a month, two weeks out the year, plus you get paid training. And uh, just like a reserve component of the Air Force Reserve, we also offer benefits that come with that. It's awesome. You know, the, the best part is just uh, running into uh, members of the VFW, the American Legion, seeing those guys all decked out with uh, their uh, badges and awards. You know, it's, it, it means a lot and uh, it just the, their sacrifice for, uh, for our country. The Army right now, at the State of the Army, we're looking for the best and the brightest. We just want to put out that, you know, the Army is not a last resort. Uh, for any student or person uh, whatsoever. You know, it, it's, it's blessed me with a wonderful opportunity. I received my bachelor's degree in the Army as well as my master's. So the sky's the limit uh, in the military service as long as you uh, apply yourself. We'd like uh, the men and women on Long Island and throughout New York to get to know the men and women that make up their uh, U.S. Navy. Yeah, well, you know, one thing that just about everybody knows about the SEALs is how physical they are. You know, I mean, part of the, the school and the training for uh, the SEALs, you know, swimming, athletics, but it's also very, very mental as well. A lot of people don't realize that the amount of mental uh, endurance that you need um, to make it as a SEAL is pretty high up there. Oh, you, you can't beat that, you know, the, the Blue Angels. They're, they're the best of the best, I think, is, uh, is a proper term to use, and it fits in this case. I'm looking forward to see the show myself. I've been in the Navy for 22 and a half years. I haven't seen a Blue Angels show yet, so I'm as excited as everybody else. I really am. I'm not from this country. I came here from Cuba in 59, and I felt that it was my obligation to give back something to this country. And it's just... It's ironic because I came here from Cuba and my sons are serving this country, you know, so I'm very proud of all the kids that serve, men, women, you should serve your country in any capacity. I'll see you up there in a few short minutes.